I am the very model of a third of the criminal Who tell the truth, the dream is just making me quite miserable All my crimes and tactics are at best described as risible This dog of course distracting me by dancing like an imbecile My movies from the comics are not even slightly relevant. My character is suffering from extreme underdevelopment. Costume makes it obvious, designers had a lack of care. Huh. And so my look is best described as angry swerve in fetish wear. And so his look is best described as angry swerve in fetish wear. And so his look is best described as angry swerve in fetish wear. So his look is best described as angry swerve in kinky fetish wear. <laughs> Fifty Shades of Blue. Even when I had the old my house was kicked without much fuss, my attempted rayons and that really was her ribberless. With two plans and tactics which are best described as risible, I am the very model of a third and super criminal. With stupid plans and tactics which are best described as risible, he is the very model of a third rate super criminal. Oh, don't be so hard on yourself. You can judge a villain's power by the status of his enemies. Loki battles brother for the god of thunderous energy. The Joker and the Penguin both of Batman with great potency. Who you kicking star off? You nail a total nobody. Well, at least I'm not being more emo than Kylo Ren. <laughs> oh, not for villains, I am really an embarrassment. You wouldn't catch me being being so damn unintelligent. Who would be on the end? It would be clearly very, very wrong. And we're running out of time, so we had better rush the stupid song. We're running out of time, so he had better rush the stupid song. We're running out of time, so he had better rush the stupid song. Oh. Running out of time, so we had better rush his bloody stupid song. Ah, just get out of the way! With my general stupidity, it's better to be evil. And wonder Marvel didn't want me back to do the sequel. The stupid plans and tactics which are best as hard as possible. I am the very model of a third super criminal. and of course Star-Lord in the video as well. He would have uh, he would have been both person, both people at the same time on stage, except that's not actually possible. So very thank you very much for opening our masquerade there. And a rocket penguin cosplay there as uh, as yes, Ronan the Accuser from Guardians of the Galaxy. We now have some young cosplayers. Uh, the first one is for you Homestuck fans out there. There's got to be a few of you. You used to be noisier than that. <laughs> You've gotten older and quieter. Uh, this is Phantom Trash 3000. Uh, please welcome Friska Circuit, young and mischievous spider troll with too many irons in the fire. <laughs> Just like I look 
and make sure May go to Tokyo Toys because Tokyo Toys do like giving a free present to our young cosplayers. Big thank you to Tokyo Toys for supporting our youngest cosplayers. And I think uh, this will be our first performance of the afternoon, but uh, it is a, a couple of uh, juniors performing, so they're not just cosplaying here on stage, but they are performing for us as well. Uh, this is Millie as Katori and Mia as Umi. They are cosplaying as idols from Love Live School Idol Project.
as Larissa as Ruby. I'm not even going to double check whether or not there are any fans of this particular franchise in the house, but it would be a very peculiar Comic Con if there weren't any fans of this. As we have Tab Fun Loader coming up on stage as Kylo Ren and Ray from Star Wars. <laughs> It's just us now. Han Solo can't save you.
Um, Nina and Maud weighs on one. This is Zoe and she's here as a big daddy bouncer from Bioshock. <laughs> She's actually dressed as a little sister, <laughs> which I think is an extra bonus for that costume. Just give it a moment to get clear. You see, it's not a small costume at all. It is a very impressive costume. The streets of Paris are safe, thanks to Ladybug and her miraculous. And... Fantastic uh, recent animation co-produced by France and Korea, I understand, but there is now an English dub as well. Do track it down if you want some nice, safe, feel-good magical girl shows uh, uh, having had your heart destroyed by Madoka many years ago. Um, uh, we have um, a, a match made in a very curious part of Villain's Heaven next. Uh, as Natalie and Aaron come on stage as Maleficent and Bane. Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? 
It's much, much easier to leave the stage by these steps rather than via, via the transport lift, believe me. Okay, another performance for you now. Please welcome to the stage the uh, Majime Idols. They are performing Kage no Shirode Odolitai. as Fawn from the Disney Designer Doll series. Animal groups have all kinds of fun names. Really? Like, what else? Aha! Uh -huh. I'm glad you asked. Well, you live in a gaggle and coyotes in a pack and a group of children. 
killing bitches called a slip. Here's a rookery of seals and an army made of ants. By the seashore, you can find a book of cormorants. The yellow of zebras, hover of crows, lions of prizes. as everyone knows. There are quivers of cobras and shivers of sharks. And an exultation is a group of larks. How did she really rehearse this? You've got triples full of working legs, and starting with the crafts, and the loveliness of lady must just look so sad. A couple of these couple of butterflies, a scurry full of squirrels, and this load of hippopotami are happy girls. Or gifts of puppets, geese of raccoons, stand up flamingos, troop of baboons. A crowd of bugs becomes a clash, but my house is kids make even bigger crash. Announcement. I, I will point out that uh, we allow people to, to choose their own announcements. So, uh, <laughs> fantastic. Right. <laughs> Not that light. I have a surprise for you all. Our next cosplayer is Five Nights at Freddy's Trash. But I have an even better surprise for you, and you're not going to believe this, we found one. A real one. Freddy's fans are trash, although I do think it is the best game to watch somebody else play um, rather than play yourself, because their reactions are so much more satisfying. Okay, uh, we, our next cosplayer uh, have chosen Monica Sassy Sauron, and this is a female version of Sauron from Lord of the Rings, uh, with a breastplate instead of a chestplate. Um, so yes, Sassy Sauron as a Femme Sauron from Lord of the Rings. Visitors to the wild, but now it seems they arrive in court. I spotted 
Dragons of Creation as Yukihara from Shokugeki no Soma. <coughs> And uh, yeah, you can go that way. Um, as uh, you can have a form from Shoki no Soma, also known as Food Wars. And yes, that's an anime uh, and manga that's pretty much what it sounds like. They cook meals at each other a lot. Yeah, I'm not going to say that because the microphone. A family friendly show and everything. Don't repeat that. <laughs> Family friendly show, la la la. You're welcome. <laughs> Our next cosplayer is Dutton Says Hi, and he's cosplaying here as Genji from Overwatch. Woo! from Frozen. Yeah. 
Your cosplay representative for 20 